This video will cover how to import your Edgewise wall model into Revit. Once you have your .c3rvt file from Edgewise, we can proceed with the import process into Revit. After opening Revit and loading your project, or creating a new one, navigate to the Edgewise Import tab in the ribbon. Click Open Model, locate your .c3rvt file for your walls, and click Open. This will open the Building Import Options dialog box. In this dialog box, you have the control to determine how as designed versus as built you want your model to be. The first option is elevation alignment. This allows you to assign an edgewise level with the Revit level for the starting point of your project. Level mapping will map levels in edgewise to existing levels in Revit if the elevation of an edgewise level is within the given tolerance of a Revit level. Primary angle snapping will rotate walls to 15 degree increments if they fall within the given angular tolerance and the displacement of the endpoints is less than the given maximum. Secondary angle snapping will rotate walls not affected by primary angle snapping to the desired angular increment if the displacements of the endpoints are less than the given maximum displacement. Otherwise, smaller angular increments are used. Dimensional snapping will snap endpoints of walls to the nearest respective increment if the walls are orthogonal to plan north. Wall thickness increment will snap wall thickness to the nearest respective increment. Allow wall joins will attempt to join walls that overlap. Of course you have the option to turn off any combination of these settings if you wish. Once you have chosen your desired settings, click Start Import. If your project has no coordinate system offset or rotation to true north, then you can choose to let edgewise offset the survey point and set the rotation to true north, so that the walls come in orthogonal to project north and close to the project origin. If you wish to do this, click yes, or you can click no, if you prefer edgewise not make these adjustments. If your project already has a coordinate system offset or rotation to true north, then this dialog box will not appear. Once Edgewise has completed your import, you will be given a report that shows how many walls were successfully built, as well as where to locate your import's log file. From this point, you are free to treat this project as if it was natively created inside of Revit.